Hey, I'm back to do a what's in my bag. I'm going to start with this one. This is the bag I'm taking everything out of. Remember this bag. I have my initials on it. And it's pretty jam-packed. So... This is my little wristlet. I gotta change my stuff out of here onto this. So I'll do that later. But in my bottom zip pocket, I only had that little wristlet in this because I would fill that pocket up with peppermint. Because I went to Sam's Club and got these little peppermints on sale for $1.91 and it looked like it had 500 in there. So then we're gonna start. I have my smell good, which I'm almost out of that one. That's my first bottle of spray which I never use the whole spray my wallet y'all y'all know my wallet uh an ink pen which going back into the pouch it was in my work badge in a little back wall pocket that's what I have my Carmax and my lip oil which I prefer my Carmax more than that And then I have my, I gotta put my headphones back. I was listening to them, using them in the day at the shop. Then I have my makeup bag, which has all my essentials in it. This does not normally be in there. This is my, I was writing a grocery list with that. I have two, two napkins. I have one with something written down on it, so I need to write that on there because I didn't have that notebook in there. My headphones have to go back up in here. I have my big lotion. I have my hand sanitizer, my small one. I have to fix my clamp on this one. And this is my Hello Beautiful hand cream, which I normally have all that in my pouch. This is my essential bag, which has everything that's excess in my purse that I don't need floating around have my rat tail comb to dig in my scalp if it's good to eat you. My pill box. Uh, what else I have in here? Oh, so many. this. What is my came from? Is this the change from earlier today? I think so. Because I'm not going to Yeah, that's the change from earlier. I'm not going to I'm not carry cash. And some receipts. What's this a receipt for? Probably food, because that's all I have receipts for. Yep, that was when I got that deal on my pizza. That was cheesecake. That was cheesecake. And that was Forever 21. Yeah, I gotta fix my clamp on my, what you call them? I hit it when I was fussing walking out the building and my tweezer came out of my cosmetic pouch and then I have my big pack of gum my union book oh this was a coupon already that's already expired my union book which is good till next year and my tags for the bag and my coin case are all in this little back wall back here. So, other than that, it's empty. So what I'm gonna do is take the paper that I had in the other bag and stuff that up in here to keep it nice and fluffy. Nothing like a flat bag. I'm going to use it. And it's probably going to take all the paper. Yep. And I'll put it, because I have an extra duty and birthday. I forgot to, when I gave my sister the purse, I didn't give her the other, uh, what you call them, bag. So I have that bag to put it in. But yeah. So that's all my stuff I carry in my purse on a daily basis. And this is 
it. I'm about to go back to the closet for time being. And I'll put that back up in the closet for time being up inside another bag. And then we'll go placing my stuff in my other bag. Now in the back wall pocket, the one, the short one that's in the back, I'm going to put my union book because I love keeping that with me. No, I'm going to put it in here where I can put legs straight. And I'll put my pack of gum because there's nothing like having a pack of gum with you when you go somewhere. And then I'll put, I'll get rid of these receipts. I'll put this bag, this is just a catch all for everything. Where's the ink pen? Oh, here it goes. My catch all bag with my ink pen and stuff to the back. First, put that to the back at the bottom. And then I'll put my makeup bag in to the front. And then I'll put my lotion. And I'll put my body spray. in there, and I'll put my, what you call it, and in this part, I'll put my coin purse, and let's see, in one of my pockets, I'll put that, that hand cream, and that. This is crazy if all the stuff out of that big old coach bag fit up in here with no problem. That's going to be weird. Because I could let this be a bag charm, but I'm not. I'll just put that in there. I'll just put that sideways in there right there. in a wallet. So what I'm doing. So I'm going to hang this. No. You know what? I may have to use my other one, but I'm going to fix this when I have a plier to fix that with. I'm not putting my, uh, I am going to use it as the, the case. I gotta put my work badge in. Work badge goes in the back pocket. Work badge going up in the pocket. Yeah, put that in there. And this is going to go in the front because I could put my work badge in the front, which I might do just to save space. But this is going to go in the front with my stuff in it and my keys. So with that being said, I won't be losing anything. And my sanitizer, I have one with a rubber, uh, with the rubber, uh, thing that can go around the top of it but I got I was able to get everything in it um I might put my lip glosses on the side and put one of my sanitizers on the side to an extra one and have it right here on the outside 
like I have this one so I can grab it put one right there and then put an actual one hanging but I gotta change my stuff out because I'm not gonna use my purse I'm not gonna run the risk of scratching it when I put it in and out I can stick it straight up and down in there but I'm not even gonna do that because I have everything else situated situated like this so with everything being situated I have both my catch-all my personal my medicine because I do need that I have my lotion and my body spray that I carry all the time I have my uh, Carmex my lip oil my hand cream and I have my sanitizer on the side so as long as I have my essentials I'm good and in the front my work badge my work badge and everything will be here with the keys in the bag so technically I did get everything in there well with that being said I want to thank y'all so much for watching my what's in my bag video I changed from my coach Charlie backpack to my Michael Kors Abbey backpack for the month of uh, February. I'll give y'all details of how this holds up, if I have any issues with it, if I have any issues with cracking, wrinkling, or anything out the ordinary. I'll give y'all an update on it. So far, the Charlie backpack, the only way I scratch it is if I rub it up against the wall. That's the only thing. And that's because I'm clumsy. Not because of the bag or anything. That's me being me being me so other than that thank you all for watching i'm about to transfer my cards from one case to the other and my keys from one case to the other but i want to thank y'all so much for watching my videos rate comment and subscribe and thank y'all so much for watching hope y'all have an enjoyable rest of y'all week i'll see y'all soon Bye.